once again, I don't want to have it back. I am just lying to myself. This is what I've been expecting to hear from you. Now, I'll have to go back and discuss with my kids men so that to know when we are coming back here hmm? to pay the bright price of your daughter and the traditional marriage. Be war, Melanie. You know the tradition. Yes. Um, there's no problem. Mm -hmm. Whenever you and your kids men are ready, I am waiting. I know. Eh? I am waiting. My daughter Match is your son's <laughs> wife. Your daughter-in-law. Yes, eh? yes. Your daughter-in-law. Yes. They're not going back. Mm. Mm? So, another thing. Mm? Please, the chef Vedika, always allow her to be visiting us. You want to go? Oh, yeah, you want to no, see, at least to do one or two things for us. Oh, Omara and Yaka, and Yamaru Poyaka, you want to go? All these things, like I said, Una no Bago, she's only uh, your son's wife. Anytime you want her to come, she will come. Bam. Even if you want her to sleep over like one or two days. Eh? Bam, 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 that is, I don't know how to, I don't know how to express my choice. Oh, God, we're doing it. Oh, we're doing it. Oh, we're doing it. My regards to your family. I will. Come on, come here. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Hey. Okay. What? I'm going to go. 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 Your Majesty, what is it? You look so worried. Well, uh, I call you so that we can talk. I, I, I am deeply worried. What is it about? Our son, Chike. This is five years we traveled back to the United States. And he hasn't come back to do the name. It is no longer on his side. All his legs are married with children. Chica is not thinking about this. I am worried. My cabinet members are also worried. What if something happens that I join my ancestors? He is the heir apparent to the throne. I don't want to get deeply over this matter. It's alright. Your Majesty. Wokuku. Everything you said are correct. They are all correct. But the question is. Send for him. Yes. I will tell him to come back within the next five days. If he fails to do so, I will die. Ha! Don't talk about death all the time. Please, stop it. You want to make me a widow? Stop it. It's alright. But, Your Majesty, what if you send for him and he refuses to come? He has no right to say no. I am his father. And I'm sure he would not want to lose me. It's alright. If you sit. Alright, just call him. I will die for your love. I'm in love for your love. Oh, Chineke. Ma, what are you doing? Where's Neka? Ah, Umachi. Neka is not back from school. Oh. She's not yet back. I want to get some work and prepare some things so that when she come back, she'll take over from where I start. Come on, don't worry. I'll fetch the water. You can uh, go inside. Uh, okay. mm -hmm. Just small. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Come on, man. 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 Come on,
Like this. Who else is not my mother? Ah, ah. Your mother? No, no, no. I'm sure you upgraded more than what she taught you. <laughs> ah, ah. Neka! Neka! What do you want from Neka? I want her to get me water. Why not drink this one? Don't no worry, you can take it. I'll go and get mine. Nothing can separate us, baby man. Not even our parents love mm. more. No matter the conditions, we never compromise. If you live in me, I go die. You are my joy. See me as a person when not get a sense. Now your love will be my sense. This is our love, baby. No let her more die, sweetie. This is our love, baby. No let her more die, sweetie. Nothing can Oh, I'm so happy to be here. Oh, good to see you too. Oh, my God. You've added so much weight. Come on, Mom. I'm not. Mom, shut up. Now tell me, who has been feeding you there? You're talking about Adam. There is Pax. See what happened. We'll discuss all that. Let's all get right, it. Come, come, come on, baby. 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 Sense for me. Uh, yes, uh, sit down. So, our people used to say, when you see a toad running in the daytime. If it is not after something, something is after it. There is a time for everything under the sun. I think now is the time for you to settle down. Have you ever wondered what will be the position of this when I will finally join my ancestors and nobody is there to inherit my throne. That's the reason we decided to ask you to come home and do the needful. Son, this is the time for you to get married and settle down 
as the heir apparent to the throne. Mom, you just have what Dad said. Is it what the both of you agreed and sends for me to come back home? Oh, yes. Yes, my son. And I would like you to do exactly what your father said. Because your mom here, <laughs> I want to carry my grandchild. True. Well, um, mom and dad, that won't be an issue at all. But I will have to travel back to the United States to bring Dan with me, the woman I am already in love with. In fact, I am already engaged to an American lady. Oh, come on, son, stop talking that nonsense. You know the traditions of our people. How can you bring in a foreign woman into our land? It's never done. We have beautiful girls in this kingdom you can choose from. Dad, I'm sorry to disappoint you yet again. Dad, it is not possible. It's, it's, it's not fair. How would you expect me to just end a relationship I have been building for a very long time? For what? For our customs and tradition of our community? Dad, this is 2021. This is not the 90s. Stuff like that don't happen anymore. Mom! You, Mom, you know this is not fair. Okay, let's just assume I'm gonna work with this proposal of yours, right? So how am I supposed to get married to these women that I don't even know? How? Oh, come on, Chike. That's not an issue. Your father here, the Igwe, is capable of handling everything. So relax! All I want you to do is for you to think about it and very fast. Forget about every other thing, please. Uh, I, 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 I'm going to think about it. But I can't promise you I'm making a decision. I can't promise. I feel like both of you have conspired against me right now. So, uh, Mom, I don't like this. Mom, I'm surprised you're supporting dance. Well, in this voice, <laughs> when they go to overseas, they automatically I'm come telling to you. Yankee. I'm telling you. <laughs> uh, my love, yeah, the reason I said you come today, you know, was to talk is uh, something very important. Because uh, I like planning uh, and I want us to plan for ourselves and our children. After this is your secondary school, I want you to continue your education, but in another direction. Uh, I want you to enter no sales school. Really? Yes. Wow. Yes. That's a lovely idea. I like it. You like it. So soon as I'll be a nurse and I'll be giving you injections. Forget about that injection, sir. Which was injection? Uh, they stopped selling the phone uh, for this year. So next year, uh, they'll start selling. So I want you to buy uh, the phone. Then you take the exams and start. No problems. I'll wait. Mm -hmm. Next year is not far. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. So I want you to do this also. Mm -hmm. You know they say, and I don't mind this devil's workshop. Uh, I don't want you just to be aimless and not doing anything. So you get a provision store. Uh -huh. Uh, and you'll be selling some things there so that you can save money for your nursing school. Uh, okay, then that's a good idea, but where are you going to get money to open a provision store for me? What's wrong with you? I told you I like to plan. Just go and get the store, I will pay. Yeah, so, when you're in the store, I'm in my transportation business, uh, two of us will be making money together eh, and saving for our children. Oh, my lovely husband. Uh, you're the best. Thank no, you. Don't worry, I'll go and get the provision shop so you can pay for it. Uh -huh. Please, please, don't waste time. Eh? Uh, you know, you know how to make magic, so is it possible you make food for me? What do you want to eat? Anything you see in that kitchen now, anything, any food stuff you see, just, just make anything. Okay. Okay. Eh? Why, Oma? Something greater than the termite has entered the termite's hole. There is trouble in the 
destroy your house. And the witches will affect the entire if the kingdom. Hmm. As usual, I summoned all of you for us to put our heads together and find a solution. You all know my son. He came back from the United States. I asked him to come back home for the purpose of getting a wife. Who will be the queen hmm. of Ehite? When I might have joined my ancestors. Hmm. But in the course of our discussions, he told me he has an American girlfriend, eh? a fiance, <laughs> whom he intends to bring down to Ehite <laughs> as a wife. <laughs> Oh, oh, man, the same for several. Some such an abominable. Yes. But I am suggesting that if you all will go home, gather your daughters. To this palace in the next Afomaket day, so that the prince will look at them and choose from them who will be the queen of Ifite. Your Majesty, I have a question to ask. Oh, please go ahead. Have you discussed with the prince mm -hmm. to let him know the procedure you have just described? I have discussed with him and uh, he is in support of what I've just said. Okay, because we're in modern times and this prince has been in America for so many years. Honestly, he called himself uh, the digital age. <laughs> <laughs> so, they are not likely to accept this kind of procedure. But if he has accepted, then we are good to go. That's right. My fellow elders, you've mm -hmm. all heard what the Igwe, in fact, my, what the owner who said. I heard him very clearly. And I believe the rest of you did. Mm -hmm. Good. Uh, the problem now is, based on what the owner who said concerning me, Civilization. You see, our girls, majority of them are graduates, well schooled. And you see, some of them are even still in the university. These are not people you just call from the streets and then tell them to come to the palace and keep up for things like this. Because one, they are going to see it as insult. To call all of them from their various endeavors to come to the palace and queue up for the prince to pick a wife from amongst them. I don't think it's uh, it's, uh, it's it's right. That's another point. Well, um, <clears throat> I've heard you. Please uh, go home. Convince them. Talk to them. Find a way to convince them to come and accept. Well, as for my daughter, she doesn't live with me here. She's in Enugu. So it's going to be difficult. Uh, well, when you get home, tell others. Oh, well, <clears throat> we all have heard what 
His Majesty said. Well, let's go home and inform our daughters. Okay. And he said, convince them. Your Majesty. What is this girl still doing? Uh, Amara. Amara, what are you still doing there? We are running the Yes. You've not told me what we're going to do at the palace. What what is it you want to hear from me again? Have I not told you that the prince is back from abroad and he said he wants to see you? See me? Yes. What for? If you want to see me, you should come and see me himself. Besides, I don't even know him. You don't need to know him first. Let's just get to the palace. Then you will know the reason. Let's go. Time is not on our side. Eh? We are, we are, we are. Let's go. <laughs>
what was that silly attitude you displayed today? Eh? I don't understand you. What do you mean you don't understand me? I brought some beautiful gears from across the village for you to select from them. They want to be your wife and you turned all of them down. Why? That you insult me. You insult me and I wonder why you do that, Dad. How do you expect me to stoop so low and marry one of those girls you brought? How? After spending all my life in the United States? That in a nutshell, those girls are cheap. They're just cheap. What do you expect me to tell my friends when I get back to the States? How would I introduce them? So, what do you intend to do now? Simple, the, the, the custom and tradition of our land demands that I, I must marry someone from here. So, the, the search must go on. Mm -hmm. The search must go on. So, what if after the search, you still not find any of them suitable? What do we do? Keep searching. Oh, we keep until, searching until I find someone perfect for me. Isn't that what you want? Mm. Um, calm down, Your Majesty. I will talk to him. No way, talk to him. You better do. Machi, I'm so happy for you. See your shop, so filled with goods. See customers are just coming in and going out. Ne, you're so lucky. You. My dear, let me thank this God though, for using a kennel to open the shop for me. Yeah. Uh -huh. What about the nursing form I told you about? Calm down, your blood is too hot. Don't worry, when it's ready, I'll let you know. It's not, there's still time. There's still time. There's still time. Mm, there's still time. Uh, thank God, there's still time. Oh. At least before then, I must have saved enough money from this shop yes. to buy the form. And I know Ekene will also assist me. Yeah, sure. Hi. Wow. What do you go drink? I'm not just come to my store and not take anything. What do I have for you? Drink Coke, the chillest one inside our freezer. The yeah. chillest Coke oh, and man, bread. I'll have bread. I will die for your love. I'm in love for your love. They say I'm crazy, but in a love they hide me. See me as a person when not get a sense. Now your love will be my sense. Akene, you sound distressed. What was the problem? What? Police arrested you. What's your offense? Your papers. But your papers are complete now. Is this is no oppression. I should go and see the Igwe. Don't worry. I'll, I'll, go, I'll, I'll let him know immediately. Don't worry. Oh, you'll be fine. Wait. I'm, I'm going now. I'm going. Now. Let me just. Hey. 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 My daughter, how are you? You, you are so happy. Your Majesty, I'm not fine. See, well. Oh. 
So what is the problem? The police arrested Ekene. What? What police would dare arrest Ekene? And what was his offense? Your Majesty, they said his boss papers expired six days ago. He was trying to explain to them, but they refused to listen to him. So he told me to come and inform you. It's all right. Don't worry, I'll handle it. Uh, DPO. Yes. How are you? Mm. One of my boys was arrested by your man. His name is Ekeno Fabike. Yes. yes. They are charging him for expired vehicle particulars. And now listen, DPO. I want him back to my palace immediately with the vehicle. Thank you. My regards to your family. All right. Don't worry. Thank you, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, I would like to go now. Customers might be waiting for me at my shop. Good day, my prince. Uh, good day. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, Your Majesty. You're welcome. Why were you staring at her like that? Who is she? She is a machi, a Kenes wife to be. Is there any problem? There's no problem. I. I was just thinking about something. Mm. Uh, there, there is no problem. He's a man. He's free to admire anybody. But she is a no go mm. Already this early. And why are you passing around? What's the matter? Um, it's about that girl. Which girl? The girl I, I saw yesterday. By name Machi. Okay, what about her? I since yesterday I saw her, I have not been at peace, Mom. My heart longs for her. I think I found the one I want to be with. I, I want to marry her, Dad. Never. Don't even talk like that again. No. That girl belongs to another. Why? Why can't she belong to me? Young man, listen. A listing good. Better use your time to think of something else. Or think about those girls we assembled for you the other time. Forget about Machi. She belongs to someone else. But dad, dad, you said she belongs to someone else. And they are not yet married. I said, forget about her. She belongs to her. And they are not yet married, dad. Um, I think I'm done with this. Excuse me. Mom, aren't, aren't you going to say anything? Something like what? You better listen to your father and stop it. Stop that joke. That girl belongs to a Kenne. Ha! She belongs to a Kenne. She can also belong to me. She can also belong to me, Dad. Get out. Mom, 
Mom. Mom. Chike, why are you not eating? I'm not hungry. <laughs> but why are you not hungry? Why would I be hungry? Why? You're aware that mom and dad asked me to come back home to get married. Mm -hmm. I came back. I found the girl I want to get married to, and now they have refused. Be refused? But, Mom, Dad, why? Why don't you ask your brother who the girl is? Ask him. Tell me, who is the girl? Her name is Amachi. What? <coughs> Umachi. Then <laughs> Kenneth's wife to be. Oh. <laughs> Brother, don't you dare disrespect our traditions, okay? What do you tell, tell him? Even you, even you too. Listen. You see that girl, Umachi? She is a no-go area. Mm. Even the richest man in this country cannot marry her. <laughs> Except Ekene. So I suggest you start fishing somewhere else. Oh. I'm, not, I'm not going to take this embarrassment from you. For real, for real woman. If I don't marry that girl, Machi, I'm not marrying anybody. My heart longs for her, and that is final. Mm, Elma, your heart is deceiving me. Mm? This, I want to go mad. Come back here. Chicken. What? My son, your brother and I called you so we can put our heads together and find a way to avert this looming danger. What you are about to do is an aberration. Since the history of this kingdom, it's never been heard that out of Marriage is violated. There are consequences for such violation, which is one, madness, death. These are two things who would not wish our son. Out of marriage is very effective when presided over by the chief priest in the presence of elders and on no account shall it be violated. So please, forget about the match for now. Dad, I don't know why I have to keep saying this. I don't know. The world is changing. The world is evolving. Nothing is constant. This custom and tradition was made by men and can also be abolished by men. Thank God you are the king. 
It's so easy for you to just abolish this tradition. I, I don't know why we're making a big deal out of this. Listen to me, Prince. This is not the issue of abolishing tradition or not. Now, let me make it clear to you. You cannot marry that girl called Machi. She belongs to another. Come on, there are too many pretty girls. I mean, lovely girls in this kingdom. You go pick one and settle down with and save us from the stress. What's all this? And besides, I don't have powers to abolish what I did not create. No, I'm me. The tradition have been there. So? I don't have powers. And it will remain here when I will join my ancestors. It's, it's obvious. At, at this point, I just noticed that you both don't love me anymore. Yeah, you don't. You, you can't even bend a common tradition or custom for your only son. We do love you, son. That's why we don't want you to get yourself involved in this scandal. If you love me, Dad, you have to do something. You have to do something about this. Absolutely, there is nothing anyone can do. Really? <laughs> nothing anyone can do? Nothing anyone can do. Okay. I know what to do. There's nothing you can do. No what to do. What do you want to do? Prince! What? What's happening here? Uh, uh, are you traveling? Why are you packing your things? None of your business. None of my business. But since when do you... Mom! When do any of you care? They pretended as if you all care. None of you do care. See what he's doing. He has never packed anything in days in his life. Look, what are you doing? Why are you packing your clothes, son? Can you stop? Stop! What are you up to? What am I up to? Mom, you ask me what am I up to, really? Like. You're gonna pretend as if you don't know what the matter is? You're gonna also pretend as if you don't know what. Okay, I'll pretend as if I didn't hear that. Stop you. And by tomorrow morning, I will be in the United States. You don't touch my bag again. You guys won't let me marry the girl I love, so just let me go. Let me go back to the States. Let me continue my life. No, 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 no. Stop it. Your Majesty, do something. I do not want to lose my son. Hear him. See the person? So, no, no, please. Could you, could you talk to that or something? Right. Do not pack anything. Don't move a muscle. Make sure he doesn't pack anything. Okay, okay, I will. Drink and the cola mat. You're yeah. welcome. Yeah. Hey, all of you. Mm -hmm. Lord, you know. You know why I'm here now. I dare call you a cocona. It's to inform you eh, that I and my king's men will be coming to your house in the next four Nkwa Market days to pay your daughter's bride price and the traditional marriage. <laughs> all of you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, mm. I've heard everything you said. Mm? I'm happy. Thank mm. you. I'm happy. Thank you. 
Um, I will inform my kids men. Okay? Uh, tell them about everything we discuss here. How we manage our men and women. Um, also we have um, that list I gave to you. Mm. The second one. Okay. So please, if you reach your house, get to have use by add one good. Okay. Mm, the tattoo is forgot it. Mm, no, so just add it and then you go man your mother for two cartons. Two cartons. Mm, everything in your camera because that day I don't want any story. Oh, I'm telling you. Oh, I have to go back to the police. Oh, wait. Ah, oh, God. No, 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 no. Hey. Hey. Ah, Jack. Jadu. Lai. Oh, Jack. My uncle. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. My uncle. My kid. I called you. Because there is fire on the mountain. Your Majesty, what happened? Did somebody die? If somebody had died, I wouldn't have been disbordered. Oh no, my son wants to bring shame and condemnation to the royal family and the entire kingdom. Your Majesty, you speak in riddles. I don't understand. Eh? Good he is here. He insisted that he wants to marry Machi. Eh? Ekenes fiance. And he threatened to travel back to the United States. If I should say no. Machi. The same one. That we went to do the uh, marriage oath taking a few weeks ago? Yes. Yes, yeah, I've seen. The gods forbid! Impossible! Impossible. Really, though? Like, seriously? Is this the reason you asked me to stay back? To furthermore embarrass me? Is this, is this why you asked me to stay back? I thought you called Duono so you can help her push this matter to progress. If I had known this is why you asked me to stay back, Dad, I, I would have been far gone right now. I, I would have been in the United States right now, Dad. Hello. Talk to him, please. Yeah. My prince, please listen to me. What you ask for is impossible according to our customs and tradition. If anyone tries or takes steps to dissolve such a union, the result will be madness or death. That is the truth. Oh, no. My father here asked me to come back to the country and get married. I accepted. I had a relationship that was working, that was going smoothly. I abandoned this relationship and I came home in respect to my father's quest. <laughs> and you people summoned those things. Yeah, those village primitive girls for me to marry. They didn't suit me. There was no problem. Now I have found someone who I care about, who I love, and you're going to stop me because of the tradition and custom of our land? That's not possible. My prince, you see, you have to look at this. Excuse me. Please, oh no. I am really stressed about this matter. Excuse me. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no, Your Majesty. What do we do? Hmm. Your Majesty, this is a time bomb. There is trouble. But my suggestion is that.
your majesty. With that, the matter is in itself. I think you are right. But your majesty, that's still your problem. What problem? You know, Ekene is a very stubborn person. Will he agree to give magic to Prince your son? What if he refused because they have gone the wrong way? Your Majesty, this is a very important question. Don't worry, hmm? I'll handle it. A kele is like a song to me. If you say so, Your Majesty. Alright. Well, I summoned all of you here for us to put our heads together and trash out this issue that has been bothering this royal family, which is our son, the prince, getting married too much. I have discussed with my cabinet members. They've even gone to the chief priest, and the chief priest assured that there is a way out. Ah. God. God. So what's what is the way out? What is the next thing to do? The king is still talking. That the bottom line here in summary is that it's possible for me to get married to this girl. So what are we waiting for? It's not as easy as you are reasoning it now. The bottom line, like you said, is getting the people involved to agree on this marriage. And then, who oh gone? That there is nothing more required than money. For those two persons, the only thing they need is money. Let's just pay them off and shut them up. Well, son, Everything is not about money. No, Dad. Money is everything. As long as Machi and Ekena is concerned, money is everything. Kiki, what is even wrong with you? At times I begin to wonder if you reason well at all. Do not insult me. Oh, both of you, stop that. Stop it! Your Majesty. What do we do now? Well, I will send my Kenny. I will talk with him and then and know the next line of action to take. This better walk. This better walk. End. Now I believe what people say that power intoxicates. Ha! Ah, poverty is a big cause. How can Igwe ask his son, the prince, to marry Machi, a Kenny's wife to be? Even threatening that they will buy him over if he refuses. Ha, ah, God! Abomination! Die for your love, I'm in love for your love. They say I the crazy, but in a love they hide me. See me as a person when not get a sense. Now your love will be my sense. Yeah. This is our love, baby. Don't let them die. This is our love, baby. Don't let them die. Nothing can make the sweet my love. You not get counterfeit. No matter of money go buy our love. Oh. I the grace for you. Hey, the sweet my fellow. Uh -huh. You not get counterfeit. No matter of money go buy our love. Well, I'm matching Solomon. Hey, the sweet my fellow. You not get counterfeit. It the sweet me. No matter of money she go buy me. our love. Oh. She the sweet me. Hey, oh, Highness, you sent for me. 
I have a very big news for you. Yes. Something great is about to happen in your life and you will like it. Yes. You've already been doing too much for me. You've changed my life already, so I don't know what else it is, but thank you in advance, sir. Yes, Your Highness. You know we love you so much. My family and I, we love you so much. So, we were discussing yesterday, and uh, we agreed that the boss we gave you may not be fetching you so much money that will make you live a fulfilling life as a hardworking young man. So we decided that we'll buy you more buses. Oh yes. And uh, still add Five million naira. Hey! 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 Exactly, exactly. You know what you had my father say is exactly what we're going to do for you. Ah, five million. Thank you, Polo. Thank you. But on one condition. What is the condition, Your Highness? What's the condition? Just, just say it. It's already done. In the spirit, it's already done. It's only physical that is remaining. Just say it. <laughs> you see that girl, Machi, that you sent to me yes, to inform me about your police case. Yes, my Machi. Yes, when she came here, my son saw her and He fell in love with her. And, um, in fact, in the nutshell, my son wants to marry her. So if you can just leave her for, for my son, there are other girls out there you can, you can marry. I, I have never joked with a serious matter as this. I don't joke with your match, your highness. This is a joke. It's obviously a joke, your highness. It's a joke. <laughs> your highness. <laughs> wait, wait. Your highness, you, you called me here to, to, to give my match to your son and you pay me off. I, I, I don't understand, Your Highness. I, I, I don't understand. How possible? Do you, do you understand the implication of what you just said, Your Highness? It's it's not like. Hey, hey, I wasn't talking to you. In fact, let me, let me address you. Wait. Of all the women and girls in this village and the neighboring village, you didn't see anyone. It's my machi, a married woman. Is that the way you people behave abroad? No, tell me now. Is this the way they behave? <clears throat> I have discussed with the chief priest. And the chief priest said, if two of you can agree to disagree, to walk your various paths, then there no harm will come on your way. <laughs> Just agree to disagree. That's all. Agree to disagree. <laughs> I, 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 I don't believe what I'm hearing. I don't even believe that the chief priest even shared Kula not with you when we were discussing this because he knows tradition. For <laughs> I have too much respect for you. I see you like a father. So before I say what is inside my mind, uh, let me just go before my mouth starts to leak. Uh, let me just go. I don't want to say anything. Let, before my mouth starts to leak, let, let me just leave here. Your Highness. Put it into consideration. Eh? Think about it. 
What do we do now, Your Majesty? Hey, Kenneth, what are you doing here? I thought you had left for work. This is our love, baby. Papa. Papa. Papa, can you imagine? Igwe called me to come to his palace and he started telling me what I don't know. He started promising me what I don't even understand. Telling me he's going to give me 5 million naira. He's going to buy more buses for me if I can do one thing for him. I said, what is it now? He now said that uh, 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 if I can uh, allow uh, 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 Prince Chike to marry Machi. Can you imagine? He said that. That's what he said now. No. I'm telling you, that's what he said. He said I should remove my hands from there. He should know the implication of all this. But if it is true, my son, that Igwe opened his mouth to tell you all this, all the cabinet members and even the community, I will tell everybody. Because that is to show that Igwe has no respect for our custom and tradition. <laughs> Papa. If Igwe thinks because of his status, he can intimidate me to take Machi away from me, it won't happen. No. I'll do something stupid. Oh. I, I, I will do something that will shake no, this whole community. No, 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 my son, relax. Igwe cannot try that. Are you hearing me? Because he knows the implications. It's either the son dies or wrongs man. So don't bother yourself. Are you hearing me? I will do something stupid. Oh. I don't know. Why would he tell me to remove my hands from, from Machi? For what? I hope you did not tell him much. Why would I tell us such a thing now? Better. Better. Just all I want you to do is relax your mind. As far as I'm alive with this community, Igwe will not do such a thing. And in fact, he will not succeed. Okay? I'm going out. Hmm. Hey, babes. My mother said that you came to our house yesterday to look for me, though I was not around. I hope there's no problem. No problem. I only came to inform you that Ekene will be coming with his people to perform my traditional marriage rites and pay my bride price. Ah, are you serious? So I'm trying to, you know, would you like to follow me to the market to buy things? That one has now. Ah, congratulations! Don't worry, it's nothing. I will stop you. I'm so happy for you. Oh, who are they? They're from the palace. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Machi, your highness requests your presence at the palace, so you go with us. Any problem? Please, don't waste our time. Okay. Hope you'll be okay. I will die for your love. I'm in love for your love. They say I'm the crazy, but in a love they hide me. See me as a person. Your Majesty, I don't understand. You mean I should leave Ekene? Someone I took marriage oath with and marry your son. Kill me. Machi, you don't have to worry about that. Please, nothing will happen to you. My father, the king, has taken care of all of that. You're safe. You're 100% safe. And I am not interested. Look, there are so many girls in this kingdom. Go and find yourself one and leave me alone. Please, Machi. I beg you, don't do this to me. I love you. From the first day I sought my eyes on you, I have not been at rest. I want you to marry me. I want to end all of the sufferings in your life, please. I want you to become the future queen of this kingdom. And who says I'm interested in any of these things you just mentioned? Besides, do I look like I'm suffering? Excuse me. 
What are we going to do now? We have to make a move. All this while we've been making promises. They need to see things done. Sin is believing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sin is believing, Dad. Sin is believing. If a junior and water on your tribute. Why is your face like this? And why did Igwe send for you? You know the reason the Igwe sent for me is to tell me to leave Ikene and marry his son, the prince. This is this <laughs> lie? Tell me you're joking. How can I be joking with this kind of a thing? The, 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 the so-called prince said, promising me heaven and earth, that he will do this for me, he will do that for me, that he will make me proud, that I should leave a kene for him. Imagine. Does it mean that the Igwe doesn't have regard for the tradition Ask of Ask me, or doesn't he know the implications of anyone who does such a thing? No. no. So what did you do? Don't you trust me again? I told them to their faces that I will never accept such an offer. In fact, I shunned them and walked away. For babes, this is the prince and the igwe we are talking about here. The prince and the igwe are involved in this. What are you going to do about this? I don't know. Right now, my head is full. All I'm thinking about now is how to make this traditional marriage happen very fast. You know what? I'm not in the mood to attend to any customer today. Just help me sell for me. I'll see you later in the day. Hi, they take it easy, yeah? Don't worry, I'll, I'll bring the keys to the house later when I'm done. Bye. I'm love Wait, you mean if we called you to the palace to tell you all of this? I was on my way to the shop when two of his guards stopped me on the way and said the Igwe wants to see me. Initially, I thought the message was for you. Huh. When I got there, to my greatest surprise, it was saying a different thing entirely. Yeah. Igwe. Ha. My love, I, I want you to do me a favor. What is it? I think you should hurry up and come up and form my marriage rights so that this nonsense can stop. Seriously, what is wrong with Igwe? What kind of man is this? I don't understand. Well, why would you want to take away my joy? The only, the only person that makes me happy. Eh? Why would you want to take it away from me? For what now? I don't like this, oh. I don't like the way you're sounding. You're sounding as if I am going to accept this offer. Of course you know I can't. You already know the consequences. If I try it, I'll risk my life, which I wouldn't. <laughs> my love, please stop bothering yourself. Everything will be fine. I don't like the way you're looking right now. <laughs> I have to get going. I want to go home. <laughs> no problem, no problem. I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. No problem. Ah, you're not seeing me off. See me off now. No matter what you do. Sorry, sorry. Just my mind. I mean, Your thoughts are different. Gee, My majesty. You know me too well. I am a man of means. God has so graciously blessed me that my pastime now is helping out people. And it is the turn of your family to benefit from my kindness. Your Majesty, I don't understand you. I know you not understand me. You see, when Ekene wanted to marry your daughter and you refused, I was against you. But now I am beginning to see reason with you.
Jai Vajika. This is three million naira. I want to change the face of your family. I want to wipe out poverty from your family. It's for you. <laughs> you see my son here, a graduate of the United States of America University wants to marry your daughter, Machi. What? No. Igwe... No. Igwe is not possible now. That can never happen. You know the consequences. I mean, you know the implication of what you're demanding for. No. Your Majesty, do you realize what you are saying? I do, I do. No, you don't. I said I do. You see, <clears throat> convince your daughter to marry my son. I will bring my money for you. Uh, your Majesty, I cannot do what you are asking me to do. Do you want my daughter to run my or die? Have you forgotten the old taking? Yeah? Anyway, thank you for the offer. But I am not interested. You don't have to bother yourself. I will handle everything. I put machineries in motion. To contain this situation, you don't have to worry yourself. Well, Your Majesty, like I said, thank you for the offer. But I and my family, we are not interested in this money. Thank you. For now. Thank you very much for this offer. But no thanks. We don't need it. We are not interested. Iwe. Dad, those people just insulted you. You're going to let them go just like that? Palace to tell you to tell me to leave Ekene for his son. That Igwe doesn't want to respect himself, Mama. Mama, if I go to that palace, what I would do? Let me just reserve my comments. If I tell you, I was shocked is an understatement. Because I never believed our own Igwe would stoop as low as bribing your father and I to separate you and Ekene. But you know what? Don't worry. We are on that matter. We know what to do. Just don't bother yourself. You know, Mama, go. tell Papa to go and warn him. Papa should go and warn the Igwe. Hey. hey. No, I don't know whether it is too much money oh, that is intoxicating him oh, or the power of affluence. Whatever makes him think I am selling my daughter, I don't know. And I don't worry. Away back, away back for Salam Wana. This is destiny. No one can change it. Yeah. No one can change it. No Your Majesty, Nobody can change Cabinet it. Member, I'm the one that called for Nobody this meeting to help me ask our Igwe here. What I and my family has done to him that he want to put us in trouble. 
My son told me a few days ago what our Igwe told him about Machi. That he should remove his hands from Machi. And I thought my son was joking. Long thirty yesterday, Igwe called me to this palace and told me the same thing. Let me ask a question before that. Where is the chair of Ejika? Because he's supposed to be here with us. So that we can hear his own opinion. The chair of Ejika is not here. Go ahead and ask your question. My question goes to the Igwe. Your Majesty, is the chair of Ejika aware of this? Well, of course he is aware. I wonder why he's not here. My fellow elders, I'm not happy at all. The customs and tradition were there even before the Igwe was born. Why desecrate it now? He knows the law and everything. But if he insists, I will not be part of it. Let me also ask the prince. My prince. Does it mean in the whole community you can't see any other girl to marry, if not much? Iche, there are many girls in this community, very true. But I have not found the one who is compatible with me. My prince, do you know the implication or the consequences of what you are asking for? Based on that question, on implications, I went to the chief priest with Iche Akrika. And we asked him what we are supposed to do. And he told us that if the two of them can come together and agree with one mind to separate, that the prince can marry Machi without problems. Oh no, at times you surprise me. In an issue like this, you are supposed to stand on the truth. As the owner of this community, I am surprised you are, su you are supporting evil. Wait a minute. Iche Izuako, where did I go wrong? Tell me, what did I do wrong? You are not supposed to go to the chief priest place for anything at all. Well, now that it has been, what do we do? <clears throat> what I'm saying is that the prince should look for another girl to marry and leave the poor Ekene and the Machi alone. You are the true son of your father. I know. I, I, I have something to say. Like, I have something to put. My son, don't bother yourself explaining anything. I've heard you all. Let me say this so that it will sink into your heads. Machi is my son's wife. And there is nothing, anybody, any of you, can do about it. Your Majesty, is that all you have to say? Change it. Yeah. No one can change it. 
What will I do now? Huh? What will I do? According to the two, please. That two of them must agree to leave each other. Or the other person agree to leave the other. Huh? So that the sacrifice can be done, which involves cow, good, and so many other things. Where will I get money to buy all these things? The main problem there is that among my daughter and Jekyll, one of them will agree to leave the other. Because two of them are too stubborn. You have said it all. Mm -hmm. eh? You have said it all. See, um, I will do exactly what you said. Because I cannot risk the life of my daughter or bring shame to my family. Eh? It's all right. Thank you very much. I've had you. Okay. Go away. Well. Well. Yeah. No, no, no. Extend my greetings to your family. My dear. My dear, to your wife. Good. I'm just coming from the palace. Let me have some rest. Even the guy told you. That would be a problem. Just what I am after is for your daughter to accept my son's instinct And I will be ready to sponsor anything the chief priest is demanding for sacrifice. Even if it will take 20 different chief priests from 20 different communities and provide them just to convince her to wear my son. Because my son is getting in He wants to travel back to the United States. Your Highness, I've had you. But please, I want you to leave my family and I alone for now. Please, leave us alone for now. I have to take my leave. If it is again, you are working out on me. I am still talking to you and you are working out on me. Well, Your Majesty, sorry I am working out on you. But please, leave us a look for now. Because I don't want to risk the life of my daughter or make shame to my family. Please, leave us a look for now. If it is again, you are working out on me. So, Prince Chike, you and your father brought this bag of money for me to plead with my son and my husband to leave his wife for you. Um, exactly, Mama. You see, 
that is what I want you to do. You know, mothers have the special gift of convention. You just know how to convince your children into doing what they don't plan on doing. So that is why I've come to plead with you, you know, so that you can talk to your son. So let's go for Machi so that I can marry Machi. That's all. I'm, I'm, I'm also your son. You're doing it for your son as well. Yes. Yeah. Well, you're right. <laughs> okay. I've heard you. Hmm? When my son comes back, I will tell him. Uh, I will tell him to leave his wife for you. Oh? I'll call him. Yeah. Thank you, Mama. You see, that, that made me really happy what you just said now. And I really appreciate it. And um, I promise you that where this came from, there is more. And I would surprise you even more. Yes. Thank you very much. Oh, my son. I will be on my way now. Yes. And um, Prince Chicken, the money on now. <laughs> Mama, this is for you. That is why I brought the money to you. You can keep it. Thank you. I don't need it. No problem. I've heard what you said. I will talk to my son to leave his wife for you. Oh, but the money, eh, uh, take it. Oh, I don't need it. I, I think we're still having a misunderstanding. This one is for you, Mama. Where this came from, there's plenty. Plenty more for you. You can just keep this. It's from my heart. It's yours. Don't worry, take it. Oh, take it. No problem. I will do exactly what you said. Oh. Where this life come from? There is more. There is is more. There 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 is more. I didn't understand what is going on. Why don't you buy these people over with money? I've done everything I could. Money, promises, but it appears nothing is working. But never mind, I have other plans. So, Matt, please just do something and do it fast so our son can be happy. Uh, don't bother yet, sir. Uh, as for Machi, uh, she's already our daughter in law. <laughs> it's all yeah. right. I don't like the way this whole matter has been handled. I don't like it at all. Like, come on. Why are those people putting me through the stress? Over what? If they're not ready to handle this matter peacefully, let me do this my own way. My friend, will you shut up? You are the one embarrassing yourself. I'm putting this family into embarrassment. Well, since you want it this way, allow me to handle it my own way. This marriage we are talking about. Dad, I I believe at this point I should go see Machi and talk with her. She's a girl like me. I believe she might just understand. 
You think you can do that, my daughter? Well, there's really no harm in trying. It's right. uh, are, are you sure? Are you sure that is going to work? Leave it to me. I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to make a promise to you. If you can come through with this, I'll buy you a new car. Any car of your choice. Dad, did you just hear that? Like... Just imagine. Just, just look, look, look at somebody who is buying a car. <laughs> Don't worry. She is yours already. Like... <laughs> Mom, I'm going to have a new car. I'm liking the sound of that. Uh, <laughs> I love that, my sister. Um, Dad, Mom, I... I need to get to my room. I have some documents to tidy. Right. Trust me. It's all right. Sorry, I got you. <laughs> Mom, I think this time I'm just gonna choose um, a pink car. The interior is gonna be so lit and oh gosh, I can't wait. <laughs> oh my god. How are you? Listen, I came to see you to talk to you. You know, look, I don't have much time. As you can see, I'm already dressed to go to my shop. And I know why you are here. I know your brother, the prince, sent you to me. But why can't you people leave me alone? Am I the only girl in this community? Let me ask you do you have a boyfriend or a fiance? Yeah, I do. And you love him so much? Hmm. Of course, yes. Okay. If someone comes out from the blues and says you should leave your boyfriend that you love so much for another man, will you do it? You see? Now you're not saying anything. Look. Go home. Tell the Igwe and your brother the prince that I will never leave Ekene for him. It's not possible. I have already made up my mind to get married to him, and that is what it will be. If you don't mind, can I? Ned, my angel. I'm glad you came. I invited you here for us to talk. No, no. Please, stop calling me your in law. We are not in laws, and we can never be. Please, leave us alone now. You've caused enough havoc in our family. We have become the talk of the whole community. Please, what did we ever do to you? Lady, is it me? The queen of this kingdom that you are talking to in such a manner? Are you all right? Is it because my son wants to help you people? Your Highness, please. We might be poor, but we are not greedy. And we are not wicked. Eh? What did we ever do to you? Why my daughter? The only joy, the only thing I have in this my life the only voice that calls me mother. Why do you choose to treat us like this? Do you realize the, the implication? I mean, the consequences of what you're asking for. Do you know that if I, if I should do what you're asking me now, my daughter will die? Do you want her to die? Look at Ekene, that poor boy. Why do you want to take away from him the only thing that makes him happy? Because, you know, you are a mother, I am a mother. If Ekene was to be your son, would you be happy to watch someone take the only thing that makes him happy away from him? Check it out now. Whatever we have done to you, forgive us. But please, leave us alone. And please, if you don't have anything else to say, let me go before you say I have insulted you. 
enough. Get up. Now I want you to leave my sight at once. It's my to say you should come with me in the palace right now. Good morning. Good morning. Any problem? Okay, let me quickly call a Kenya. There's no need for that. Let's go. Okay. Okay, let me quickly lock my shop. Machi, I called you here. But before I tell you the reason I summoned you, I want to ask you a few pertinent questions. Are you aware your mother insulted my wife all because of you and the killing? Okay. Are you aware my family has come through a lot because of you and the Kene. The entire kingdom we are passing through terrible times all because of you and the Kene. Are you away? Your Majesty, what really have we done that is causing all these problems like you just said? Machi, it is rude for you to interrupt the king while he's talking. Chike, what is wrong in asking a question? Princess! Mom! No, listen, listen. I want to put a stop to all this nonsense. Machi, I am giving you seven days. Seven days to go and make up your mind. If after seven days, you did not make up your mind to marry my son. I will put my powers and banish you from this land. If not for anything, the insult your mother heaped on my wife. What gave her the cups? Better. Machi, I, I am disappointed at you. Come on, you're such a pretty girl, very beautiful lady. And you want to let this whole beauty waste? How would you think of spending the rest of your life with that miserable, low life, good for nothing? Good for nothing again, how? How would you? Look, I want to marry you. I want you to be part of this royal family. Enjoy everything that comes with this royalty. Why, why, why would you want to reject this for poverty? Why? Look, you have the opportunity to travel to the United States with me. Become the future queen. It might be a mistake of the past choosing a Kenya, but now you can make things right for yourself and your family. Machi, please. Wouldn't you say something? <laughs> please, Machi. I will die for your love. I'm in love for your love. They say I'm crazy. 
But in a love they hide me. See me as a person when not get a sense. Now your love will be my sense. Your time is up. Come down. I don't understand. Ikene, get down from this boss. I want this boss. I don't understand. What do you mean by you want this boss? Open this door. My friend, would you come down? What do you mean by you want this boss? I don't understand you. What do you mean by you want this boss? I want the boss. Like, I don't want you driving this boss anymore. Look, I, I know your father bought this boss for me, but I don't understand you. What do you mean by you want this boss? Good. Good thing you know my father about this boss. That automatically makes it my property. Huh? And at this moment, I don't want you driving my property. Let me have the keys. My keys? See, wait, is it because I didn't allow you to marry my wife? I didn't allow you to take my wife away from me. That's why you want to do all these things. Eh? Don't you fear God? See, oh, my people, oh, see, he's the prince of this our land, though. I didn't allow him to marry my wife. He wants to take my wife away from me. Oh. That's the problem. Mama, I've already married though. It's the problem. Oh. Now nah, he wants to take this boss away from me. Oh. I, I don't, I don't want to get, I don't want to get hostile with you. Please, all of you, this boss is no longer moving. Please calm down. What's all this now? What's all this now? What's all this now? What's all this now? You shouldn't have collected the bus for me. Ah, you went too far. It hasn't gotten to that. Father, I, I, I'm, I'm surprised you're saying this, Dad. What do you want to happen before you would know it has gotten to that? It has gotten to that and it has gone past that, Dad. Chike, let me remind you that everything you're going through today, you cost it. You just got back to the country. And the first thing you thought to achieve was to overpower Ekene and snatch away Umachi, his wife-to-be. And everyone in this community knows that that is an abomination. Just... Listen, Father, everyone should count me out of this. I don't want to be a part of it. Would you shut up? Would you stop this madness? What is wrong with you? Are you not supposed to be on my side, providing solutions for this issue? And you're here talking rubbish. What is wrong with you? And what does it look like I am doing? I am trying to help you here. Because trust me, you're going to be the one who's going to cry later. <laughs> Mark my words. I regret you being my sister. I swear. Like, I regret you are my sister right now. Then that is your business. Listen, that's it. If you heed to my advice, leave Ekene and Umachi alone. You can as well pick any other girl from this kingdom and get married to her. Or better yet, invite your American girlfriend and get married to her and spell us all these problems. Princess. Father. Glosses. What the? No. But nothing, my friend. Go inside. Just get inside. Look, Dad. Dad. Father. I, 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 I think I should go to Ekene's house with the police. Make him calculate all the money he has realized from that boss and make him pay. Shake it. Yeah. Go upstairs. I will die for your love. I'm in love for your love. They say I the crazy, but in a love they hide me. See me as a person when not get a sense. Now your love will be my sense. This our love, baby. Don't let them This our love. What's going on here? Why is everybody so quiet? My love, I didn't see your boss outside. What happened? My daughter, 
The prince has taken the bus back. He has collected it back. What? Mm. My love, is that what happened? I was driving. A car double crossed me. Ordering all my passengers down. So they said I should give him the key that his father that bought the bus. The prince went away with my bus. What kind of nonsense is this? Is he mad? My love, see, I'm assuring you, that thing that he's looking for, he will never get it. Not when I'm alive. What kind of rubbish is this? Baby, baby see, I have saved up some money from my store business. Why not add money to it? Let's get another boss. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's not rush things, please. No, I want to prove to that Igwe that he's not our god. My daughter, Ekene is right. Mm -hmm. Let us not rush buying another boss for now. Hmm? Let's watch him and his family. Hey! Igwe. Igwe. I wonder the change of attitude towards Ekene. But, my children, don't worry. Let's sit and watch like my husband said. Papa, is that what you want? We should sit and watch? Is it about the seven days banishment? Yes. Don't worry. Hmm? We have elders in this community. That Igwe is mad though. They are mad, especially that his useless son, wicked and confused. Look at the way he treated both of you. He shall never be well with them. Oh God, I tell him I'm So as to hands were ruined, he get mad. And for that reason, I am a way peace. To fear what? I don't even care about Kwanjo. I put it there, no one. Oh, we're happy. Oh, we're joy. Oh, we're happy. He can never be well with them. Say amen. Amen. Mm. Hi. Your Majesty. This is the sixth day you instructed Ekene and the Machi to go think about my son's proposal to Machi. And up until now, we have not seen or heard from them. What is the matter? You shouldn't bother yourself. It's not up to the seven days, so relax. My angel, what is it? Mom, ask Cynthia why she's crying. Cynthia, why are you crying? <laughs> what is it? Speak up, my friend! Princess, what is it? Dad, Mom, I went to the backyard. Then I saw Cynthia throwing up. And I asked her what the problem is, but she refused to say anything. I also noticed that she has been spitting around the compound. Then I pressurized her into telling me what the problem was. And guess what, Mom? She's pregnant. Cynthia. Is it true? Yes. You made you pregnant. Is 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 the prince? Which prince? Prince Tiki. Are you sure? Yes. I want to see you in my room now. Now. <laughs> he make 
love to meet that day. I noticed I stayed feeling somehow since last week. I'm sorry for your pregnancy test. And the result shows that I am three weeks pregnant. Something like that happened, Father. But I, I, I didn't know it was going to resort to things that. I, I'm, I'm sorry, Dad. That she's just trying to make herself relevant right now. Like this is not important. Oh, shut up! Ah! Ah! Prince, let me tell you, if anything happens to the Igwe, you will not smell the truth. Now look at what you have done. Eh? Look at the condition you have put His Majesty. Sing for me. Who? Please call Ekene for him. He wants you to go and call Ekene to come and sing for him. The same person you want to take what belongs to him because of money and position. You know your father is suffering from high blood pressure. Ekene is the only person who makes him happy and relaxed. Yet you chased him out. Go and call him yourself. Oh no, no, please. Please. I beg you, Biko. Please. Help me. I don't want my father to die. Please. Biko. Okay. My fellow elders. Oh no. Please go to Fobike's house. And tell Ikene that I, oh no, and all the cabinet members insist that he should come to the palace now. No, he's right. And uh, what if he refuses to come? If he can, where is he now? Talk to him, convince him, bang by him, make him come. Oh, no, he's right. It's okay. Let's go. Thank you. So it's now Igwe who needs my help. I am not God. See, I, 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 I didn't hear what you just said. I am not going anywhere. You understand me? I'm waiting for the banishment. Let him banish myself and Machi. That's what we are waiting for right now. They have done their worst. So there's no problem. We're waiting for banishment. Ekene, why are you talking like this now? Eh? Ono who sent me to come and call you. I was supposed to be here with your in law. Eh? But he looked at his head. He said he doesn't know how he's going to face you. If not, both of us would have come to beg you for this issue. Please, why not join me? Let's go and see the Igwe. What will you benefit if the man dies? I won't benefit anything. But at least I'll have my peace of mind. His threat will be over. Yes, he has done his worst now. He has taken everything from me now. Boss, taking everything, taking. So there's no problem. Ekene. But just tell him I'm surviving. Ekene. I'm alive. Ekene, listen. I'm your father. I will not deceive you. Hmm? If not for anything, Go there because of God. And the life you are going to, you know, save. Papa, am I a doctor? You are not a doctor, but you know what you have been doing for mm -hmm. him before now. If not, they can't be sending me to come and call you. Mm -hmm. Papa, I, mean, I don't understand. I don't understand what you're saying. I, 
this this life is, is something. So, it's just a give and take. Just thing. like that. So why not do this? Can I talk to you, Nas, as your father? Listen to your father. Huh? His record did not come on his own. He was sent by Ono. Oh I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Become one B, please. If not for one thing, you're, you're in love with that. Yeah. Uh -huh. Because one. You can consider this thing as a very important Just for this one, please. Your Majesty. You can see That is a good one. Your Majesty. A good one. Please. Play the flute for me. I can I please? Thank you. in your heart to forgive me. Machi is your wife and nobody can take her away from you. Sorry about my son. Every day he has taken her away from you will be returned to you in full. Please forgive us. Please. This is a check of five million naira. It's for you. Take it and make better use of your life. Huh? Huh? Please forgive me. No, no, no. Wait, please, wait, 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 please, wait. Hey! Oh no! Do so! Dad! Dad! Hey! Oh! Oh! Oh!
Chike. Are you happy now? Now that you've killed your father and made me a widow at this age. Thank you. Thank you. You are a wonderful son, Chike. I ask you this. What is the difference between you and a prodigal son? Does it mean you cannot find any other girl in this kingdom? Pretty girls here and there in this kingdom to get pregnant. No, rather you chose to impregnate a maiden walking in this palace for you and I. Shame on you, Chike. Shame. Shame on you. Let me tell you this, once and for all. Don't ever dream of smelling that true. For the day you will be crowned the king of this kingdom, I shall drop dead on that day. And my spirit will haunt you. Take care, my spirit will haunt you. Till you join your father that you sent to his early grave. Till you join your father. Mom, don't say that to him. Those words are too expensive. Do not curse your only son, please, mother. You don't understand. <laughs> My word. <coughs> I I want to talk to you about something. What is it? I I know I've been ashamed to our family. I need you to help me talk to mom. Talk to her to listen to me. Look, ever since our father died, she has not given me attention. Not even a listening ear to plead. I am sorry. I, just, I want to show that I am sorry. Do you blame her? You cost it. Do you know what it means for a woman to lose her husband because of the carelessness of her son? Do you even know how painful it is? As it stands, mom is really hot right now. And she won't listen to anyone, not even me. I know. Look, princess, I, 
I, I know that my stubbornness, my carelessness has brought shame and grief to our family. I know. And I feel ashamed of it. I am so, so, so deeply sorry about my actions. But I need her to listen to me. And I know you can help me talk to her. You're the only person she can listen to right now. Please help me. We're talking about our father, my father as well. Like I said, she won't even listen to me. But there's one person I feel she might maybe listen to, and that is the Ono. So I suggest go plead with him so he could help you come talk to mom. Perhaps she might just listen, but I don't know. I really do not know. Can I be left alone, please? If that's all you want to talk about. Please, I just want to be by myself. I'm sorry. I am too. Our people say that when you beat a child with the right hand, you draw the child closer with the left hand. Our prince has realized these mistakes and is deeply sorry. Oh no, you have been deeply sorry. Bring back my husband to life, I ask. There's no need of crying when the head is already cut off. Oh no. I would like to ask you for a little favor. I'm all ears. I would like you to become the next Igwe of Ifeti Kingdom. My son doesn't deserve it. My queen. My queen, is not in my lineage. Igwe ship does not run in my lineage. And the late Igwe, your husband, will not be happy if I do that. Then look for another to occupy the position. Oh no. My queen. This discussion is over. I want you to get another person that will occupy this position, does it? I need to have some rest now. Oh no. Sorry that I'm walking out on you. My queen, please think about it. Please. My great-grandfather was the king of this kingdom. After he died, my grandfather took over the throne as the king of this kingdom. And when he died, my late father took over the throne as king of this kingdom. 
now that he has passed. And Chike is next. But due to his mistakes, he was saying that he cannot sit on that throne. Mom, I know you know all of this. I'm just trying to remind you to understand. Please, do not do this, Mother. Please. This will bring calamity and curses on our family. Besides, Father will not be happy wherever he is to know that the throne was given to another family. Mom, please think about this. Don't do this. you said. Now if you don't mind, I want to be left alone. It's okay. I'll, I'll just go to my room. But please, Think about it. Don't do this more. Don't. I will die for your love. I'm in love for your love. They say I the crazy, but in a love they hide me. See me as a person when not get a sense. Now your love will be my sense. Hey. This is our love. Uh -uh. Don't let them know that. Why not? This is our love. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Hey! 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 My children, I called for this meeting to let you know that. Oh no came and told me how Prince came to his house and was begging him to come beg me to forgive him. It's all right. Prince, Mom, I have forgiven you. Mom, you did. <laughs> Thank you, mommy. It's okay. Oh, no. It's alright. Thank you. No more tears. I have instructed on all to tell the chiefs to hasten your coronation. Okay. And I also gave him enough money 
to go to Cynthia's house with the other chiefs to go do the necessary things. <laughs> so get ready to become a father. So it's gonna be a father and a groom at the same time. <laughs> Congrats, bro. Thank you, Thank you mommy. Thank you. Thank you. I love you, mommy. I love you. Mom, thank you. It's all right. Thank you. But I did everything. Yeah, you did. Uh -huh. <laughs> Say I the crazy, but in a love they hide me. See me as a person when not get a sense. Now your love will be my sense. Yeah. This is our love, baby. Don't let them This is our love, baby. Don't let them die. Nothing came out. Hey, you the sweet my fellow. You not get counterfeit. No matter for money go buy our love. I the craze for you. Hey, you the sweet my fellow. Not get a sense now. Your love will be my sense. Yeah. This is our love, baby. Don't let them die. Sweetie. This is our love, baby. Don't let them die. Sweetie. Nothing came out. Hey, you the sweet, my fellow. You not get counterfeit. No matter for money, go buy our love. Oh. I the grace for you. Hey, you the sweet, my fellow. Uh -huh. You not get counterfeit. No matter for money, go 